one in three people over the age of 65 will fall this year and falls have a significant impact on, on families and on society but also the, the person who actually has the fall. Our first product is QTUG or Quantitative Timed Up and Go and it's a mobility assessment of falls risk assessment technology based on a standard clinical assessment of mobility called the Timed Up and Go test. We use body worn inertial sensors and we, we capture the information about the performance of the person who's carrying out the test. And our technology compares that to a large reference data set to identify any mobility impairments, but most importantly, what's the percentage probability of having a fall? What's the fall's risk estimate, if you like? It isn't a consumer wearable technology, it's a medical device. And it's really there to uh, assist the healthcare professional in making a more informed decision about the risk for that person. The assessment takes between three and five minutes, but it captures very vital information and sophisticated information around the movement of the patient being assessed. While we're addressing falls with, with QTUG, we also see the broader mobility assessment uh, potential, uh, for example, in multiple sclerosis and uh, Parkinson's. We're currently carrying out a trial in multiple sclerosis, and we see this as a huge potential uh, for the company to explore into. We're working with Intel and GE, their joint venture in healthcare called Care Innovations. So they are going to be uh, distributing and selling the product for us in North America. And we're currently looking to raise Series A investment, and we are taken on that investment to, to take the company to the next phase of its life cycle. We have reached a number of milestones and successes. We've developed the product, we've launched it, we, we have registered as a medical device, we have a large commercial partner, but we're looking for investment to scale the company, to, to grow it and to improve profitability.